Sorry, just trying to set the timer. Well, what do we do now? Seto is alive. I have to settle the score. Will that save the planet? It seems so. Then I'm going. I'm telling you, I'm just botching everything up right now. I'll go too. There are things I need to know. About the agents? Many things. I guess it's goodbye Midgar. If I would have uh, gave Eris and Tifa better items, that would have <laughs> the fight would have gone a lot more better. But I was stupid. Tifa, I guess this is the start of our journey. You hate traveling. It's dangerous. You sure you want to go? Hmm. But you know, it should be all right if you keep your promise. All right. Red thirteen. I'm going back to my hometown. I'll go with you as far as that. Eris, you know what? This is the first time I've ever left Midgar. Really? Are you worried? A little. N no. Maybe a lot. But I have a bodyguard, right? Barrett? We told Eris' mom to go somewhere safe, so Marlene should be safe too. Yeah, she should be. She said she didn't want to stay in Midgar anymore. Maybe it's for the best. Right, let's leave. Then... Let's go. We need a leader for our journey. Of course, that could only be me. You think so? <laughs> He's all pumped. Eris says, I think it should be Cloud. Alright. Go, go northeast to a town called Calm. If something happens, we'll meet up there. Sides. We can't all be strolling around out there. It's too dangerous. Let's split into two parties. Thought you'd do that. <laughs> Later at Calm. Yeah, sorry, Barrett. Saving on the world map. On the world map, access the menu anytime and select save to save your game. That's it. We are now open world, people. We have gone open. Let me take this out one. Give it to Eris. And then she can use restore. She can have sense. Uh, Cloud will give you cover. Tifa, you can have all. This one's... This is the new one, right? Wait, then what's this one? Okay, so that's almost done. So we have three alls, and that's good, actually. I know what you're thinking. What? That's not good. No, no, it actually is good. So that way we could all power it up. Dude, don't tell me we have a third all. Okay, we don't. So we use fire. This is nine... Oh, ten, this is... Okay, so we'll upgrade this one. And this one up here, we'll, like, we'll get rid of sense this one's 39 uh 970 clouds is uh, is 39 wait okay yeah, so we'll get rid of these two um poison we'll hold on to um cover should be clouds Aris, wait there you go Aris, you have steel have ice. Alright, that's it. So this is open world, guys. This is it. And this is calm right here. That little town right there. That's where we're supposed to go. And here, the battles will be fierce. I'm telling you. Fighting. 
gotta get shit over with. Keep doing that and we'll be fine. Okay. So what level is the cloud? He's 15 and everybody else. Eris is 12. Level 12. Tifa is level 14. Alright. Let's continue on. So this is calm. So this is calm. I wonder if everyone's there already. Let's hurry over to the inn. Alright. Let's go, Cloud. Sure, let's go. Talk to this lady. Mr. Cloud, your party is waiting for you on the second floor. Thank you. Cloud, you're late. I was just... <sighs> Yo, man, you're late. Sorry to keep you waiting. Guess everyone's here now. So, let's hear your story. You know, the one about Seth Roth and the crisis of the planet. Let's hear it all. I used to want to be like Seth Roth. So I joined Soldier. After working with Seth Roth on several missions, we became friends. You call that a friend? Yeah, well, he was older than me and hardly ever talked about himself. So I guess you'd call us war buddies. We trusted each other. Until one day... One day? After the war, it was soldiers' duty to put down any resistance against the Shinra. That was five years ago. I was 16... Sure is raining hard. Hey, how are you doing? I'm alright. I wouldn't know. I've never had a motion sickness. Everything okay? Hey. Settle down. They gave uh, me some new material. I can't wait to use it. Just like a kid. You going to brief us about this mission? This isn't a typical mission. Good. Why do you say that? I joined Soldier to be like you. But by the time I made first class, the war was already over. My big, hopes, my big hopes of becoming a hero like you ended with the war. That's why I always sign up whenever there's a big mission. Kind of a way to prove myself. Say, how do you feel, Mr. Sethrath? I thought you wanted a briefing. Our mission is to investigate an old Mako reactor. There have been reports of, its, of it malfunctioning and producing brutal creatures. First, we will dispose of those creatures, then we'll locate the problem and neutralize it. Brutal creatures? Where? <laughs> the Mako reactor at Nibelheim. Nibelheim? That's where I'm from. Hmm. Hometown. So, sir, something strange just crashed in, into the truck. That would be our monster. Are you hearing this shit? Listen to the music right now. Cloud uh, makes an attack. Dragon hits Cloud. Dead. Cloud so hits second time. Dead. Oop. I hope. I hope you guys didn't just see that. Sethroth's strength is incredible. He is far stronger in reality than any stories you may have heard about him. So, where do you come in? Me? I was memorized by the way Sethroth fought. And then we reached Nibelheim. How does it feel? 
It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? So how does it feel? I wouldn't know because I don't have a hometown. Hmm, what about your parents? My mother is Genova. She died after she gave birth to me. My father... What does it matter? Alright, let's go. <sighs> the Mako smells pretty bad here. So you keep wandering around here and you'll get in trouble. Pino and Wash is so boring. You want to do what we always do? Shall we practice? Oh, you mean practice my pose? Do members of soldiers always have to worry about what others think? How'd it go? Was it like this? Good job. I don't really want to be a soldier. Let's go. Yo, wait a minute. Isn't that uh, the name of Sethroth's mother? Dude, what the heck is my dog barking at? I remember, Genova. That's that damn headless spook living in the Shinra building. That's right. Barrett, would you please let us hear what Cloud has to say? You can ask questions later. Tifa, I was only... Okay, Cloud, continue. The childhood uh, friends reunite. Another guy? Hold on. There we go. I was really surprised with Tifa. The town was quiet. Everyone must be in their houses, afraid to come out because of the monsters. No, maybe they're afraid of us. Uh, hold on. Okay, sorry about that. We leave, for the, we leave for the reactor at dawn. Make sure you get to sleep early. All we need is one lookout. So you others get some rest. Oh, and... You may visit your friend family and friends. I heard Seth was coming so I brought my camera. I want a shot of Seth and a monster. Get in by that thing. Alright. Fathead. Hey. These guys are real. You. Are you Cloud? Really? So that's how it is, huh? I'm so nervous. How come? Look, you never know when a monster's gonna show up, right? right. We could go in here. You know what? Yeah. Let's actually go in here. Welcome. Huh? Hey, aren't you? Have I been here before? I don't remember. Now you're pissing me off. This don't matter. So get on with it. <laughs> yeah. So we're actually going outside of the memories of Cloud. This is my house. It has nothing to do with what happened five years ago. Yo, I, I want to hear. Me too. It's been a long time, right? Tell us more. You saw your family, right? I don't know if I call it a family. My father died when I was still young. That's why my mom lived alone in the house. Yeah, I saw my mom. My mom, she was a vibrant woman. Hadn't changed at all. But a few days later, she died. But when I saw her, she looked fine. Um... Yes? Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Hi, Mom. 
Come, come, let me look at you. Hmm. You look so handsome. So this is a soldier uniform. Mom, I... My, how you've grown. I bet the girls never leave you alone. Not really. Yeah, we already read this. I'm worried about you. There are a lot of temptations in the city. I'd feel better if you settled down and had a girlfriend. I'm alright. You should have an older girlfriend. One that I'll take care of you. I think that's the best. I'm not interested. Are you eating right? I'm alright. The company takes care of me. Is that so? I know you can't cook. I've been worried sick about you. Cloud? You know Cloud. Isn't that right, Cloud? I'll always be your mother. Let's stop this. We nice to go in here. Cloud? Did you go in my house? Yeah. I thought you might be home. He's trying to act all, s all suave, all slick. Go here, nothing. However, you can go in here and check this out. Cloud, did you go to my room? Yeah. Receive orthopedic underwear. Puts it in. <laughs> Cloud! Just kidding. D don't get mad. Cloud, we're talking about something really important here. Did you play my piano? Yeah, I jammed on it. Now, how'd it go? I forgot. Yeah, this is... Don't even worry about that. We'll actually do this one later. We actually open something later. And good thing is that... It's not... I don't want to spoil it. Just go talk to Seth Ross. Yeah, uh, yeah. Let's go up here. What are you looking at? The scenery. I feel like I know this place. That's it? We're one bed short. We have an early start tomorrow. You should get some sleep soon. Yeah, let's get some sleep. I've hired a guide to the Maka reactor. I heard she's young. Hope we can rely on her. Once the guy gets here, we'll head it out. Listen to me, Seth Roth. In case something happens, trust me. I'll be alright, Dad. I have two men from Soldier with me. I'm Tifa. Nice to meet you. Tifa, you're the guide? That's right. It's It so happens I'm the number one guide in this town. It's too dangerous. I can't let you get involved in this. There's no problem if you protect her. Let's go. Um Mr. Sethroth, please let me take a take one picture for a memento. Tifa, can you ask him for me too? Cheese. Great, thank you. I'll give each of you a copy once I get it developed. A Maka reactor was built in Mount Nebel. The cold mountain air on Mount Nebel was the same. stairs. Talk to Tifa and she advances. It gets harder from here. Follow me. Oh, the bridge. 
flashes. Crap. <laughs> like, I laugh, like, exactly. I laugh how Sephiroth just falls. He's just like, oh, well. Well, like, this is my life. Cloud, we've already seen him fall. Piffa, not really. But I just like how Sephiroth just looks up like, uh, great. Everyone seems to be all right. Will, will we be able to get back? These caves are in, uh, entwined like an ant farm. Oh, and Sephiroth, one person seems to be missing. It may sound cruel, but we've got no time to search for him. Can't go back, so we must go on. We'll travel together from here. All right, let's go. Sephiroth again. Stare down. Hits Cloud. Not Cloud, but he's blinded. Both of Killed everything. Instant. What's this? A mysterious colored cave? It must be with the Mako energy. This mountain is especially abundant in it. That's why the mock reactor was built here. Let's go. It's just over here. We don't have to do anything else. I'm not going to waste time. What's this? A Mako fountain. It's a miracle of nature. It's so beautiful. If the Mako reactor continues to suck up the energy, this fountain would dry up too. Materia. When you condense Mako energy, material is produced. It's very rare to see material in its natural state. By the way, why is it that when you use material, you can also use magic too? You were a soldier and you didn't even know that? The knowledge and wisdom of the ancient is held in the material. Anyone with this knowledge can freely use the powers of the land and the planet. That knowledge interacts between the, ourselves and the planet, pulling up magic, or so they say. Magic, a mysterious power. <laughs> Did I say something funny? A man uh, once told me never to use uns unscientific, unscientific terms like mysterious power. It shouldn't even be called magic. I still remember how angry he was. Who was that? Ojo of Shinra Inc. An inexperienced man assigned to take over the work of a great scientist. He was a walking mass of complexes. A Marco Fountain. This is what the knowledge of the ancients is. We finally made it. We sure took the long way though. Tifa, you wait here. I'm going inside too. I, I want to see. Only authorized people are allowed in. This place is full of Shinra's industrial secrets. But, take care of the lady. Oh, man. Better take real good care of me then. Yep, let's go see what is inside this Mako reactor. <laughs> A 
Let's go. This is Genova. Alright. Or this is Genova, right? It won't open. This is the reason for the malfunction. This part is broken. Cloud, close the valve. Why did it break? He looks inside. Hmm. Now I see Hojo. But doing this would never put you on the same level as Professor Guest. This is a system that condenses and freezes the Mako energy. That is, when it's working correctly. Now, what does Mako energy become when it's further condensed? Um, oh yeah, it becomes materia. Right, normally. But Hojo put something else in there. Take a look. What else did he put? Not look through the window. Oh, you're supposed to talk to Sethra. I forgot. Ooh, what is that? Normal members of Soldier are humans that have been shallow with Mako. They're different from the others, but still human. But what are they? They've been exposed to a far higher degree of Mako than you. Is this some kind of monster? Exactly. And it's Hojo of Shinra that produced these monsters. Mutated living organisms produced by Mako energy. That's what these monsters really are. Normal members of Soldier. You mean you're... You are different. H H Sethra? No. Was I? Oh, he's going a little crazy there. Was I created this way too? Sethra, am I the same as these creatures? You saw it. All of them were humans. Humans? No way. Ever since I was small, I felt that I was different from the others. Special in some way. But not like this. understand what Sethroth meant then. I was even more surprised that Shinra was producing monsters. Damn Shinra, the more I hear, the more I hate him. Who would have ever thought the Maka Rector had held such a secret? That would mean, that would seem to explain the increase in the number of monsters recently. I think we should listen carefully to Cloud. Don't you think so, Byron? Uh, why are you talking to me? We could save the game and rest, or we can continue. Let's keep talking. Hmm, <laughs> poking his damn nose in where it don't belong. Cloud, why don't you finish that story? Phew. Tifa, were you waiting outside then? Yes. We, we returned to Nibelheim. Sato couldn't find himself in the inn. He didn't even try to talk to me. Then all of a sudden, he just disappeared, right? We found him out inside the biggest building in Nibelheim. The villagers used to call it the Shinra Mansion. Long ago, people from Shinra used to live in that mansion. 